So I guess my internet is a little slow tonight. Why? I do not know, but I'm going to go ahead and finish this video anyway. So tonight I am going to be showing you how to download and install Kodi version 21 Omega. I know recently I did it for the Xenon 2 build on the NVIDIA Shield, and I'm just going to make a solo video for Kodi. So with that said, tonight I am using the NVIDIA Shield. All right, everything is updated. And from now on, I think I'm going to start just solo using the NVIDIA Shield. Okay, all of the steps are pretty much the same for any and all Android device, except for maybe a tablet or a cell phone. Uh, but I got to say, I love the, using the NVIDIA Shield. And I'm going to start straying away from the Amazon Fire Stick because their operating system is uh, is going bye-bye, okay? So what's the point of using Fire Sticks if eventually they're not going to be uh, worth any of my videos? So with that said, using the NVIDIA Shield, the first thing you have to do is go to the App Store, Google Play Store, and download the downloader application that you can see right on my screen right now that I'm highlighted on right there. It says Downloader, okay? If you want to do this through the Dr. Venture Store, click Downloader one time once you allow it and everything allowed to come up and it should pretty much sim similarly look like this and you're going to be highlighted on go from go you're going to scroll once up to where it says enter a url search term or short code and you're going to see the cursor blinking click that one time and the keyboard is going to pop up on whatever device you're doing just make sure you have it locked into numbers okay and then you can scroll up and type in the dr venture code is nine two seven six nine all right, 92769, beautiful. Then scroll down to go or the enter button and click it. It's going to be redirecting you in about five seconds to the Dr. Venture website. <clears throat> okay, once it's here, uh, on any and all device, if you hold the select button down, you should get this screen right here. Then you can scroll once down to where it says enter current page to favorites and add the Dr. Venture store to your favorites. Uh, otherwise, you can scroll down to full screen mode and click it. And now full screen mode is up and running. And then scroll down ever so slightly. All right. And you're going to see beautiful categorized in different colors. And since we're looking for Cody tonight, I have it set for Cody versions. So we're going to scroll around and find there it is in blue where it says Cody versions. We're going to highlight it and click it the best we can. You may catch an ad. If you do catch an ad, do not be alarmed. It's very simple and easy to exit out of it right here. Click on close. Uh, I only have ads on there in order to help Dr. Venture pay for this server that you are using. OK, so do not be alarmed. Uh, but once you're in and click on close for whatever ad you're in, you're going to see index of APKs slash Cody. And I do have all of the Cody versions on there. So if you need them, feel free to come here and take them from the store. It is completely free to use. So I'm just going to scroll down ever so slightly and I'm going to find 21. Uh, let's see, where is 21? Ah, there it is. So I may have to change it a little bit to be at the end of the pack, but there it is. So it's two versions. It's Cody 2132 bit for like a lower end device possibly the Walmart on, Walmart on, and the Fire Stick, uh, and then a 64-bit, which is going to be for the NVIDIA Shield like I'm using right now. So I'm just going to scroll around. I'm going to highlight Kodi 21 64-bit and click it. You're going to see it's now connecting. File downloading, beautiful. Now, if the file does not download, you get a, a connection error. Just reboot the device, reboot your router, and then it should work. For some odd reason, if downloader has not fixed that issue yet, uh, it's a downloader issue. I don't know if it's just with my website or many other websites. So on the NVIDIA Shield, it's automatically going to boot you into the do you want to install this application menu screen, okay? Uh, from cancel, scroll over to install and click it. and Just follow along on any and all device. Just install it. And once the app is installed, uh, from wherever you are, just scroll over to done and click it. And then you're going to be booted back to the downloader application. You're going to be highlighted on install. From install, scroll once to the right onto delete and click it. And then from cancel, scroll once to the left onto delete and click it. And now what you've deleted is the installation files that you no longer need since you have the Kodi now on your device. So if you're good to go, you don't need anything else from the Dr. Venture store, hit the home screen button on whatever device you're using. And since I'm using the uh, NVIDIA Shield, it's going to be right here on the home screen. Now, this is my favorite menu bar right here. And a lot of times I like to put a lot of my favorite apps to the front of the pack on the 
menu bar list, not just for myself, but for family, for friends, you know, children, anybody that's, uh, you don't want messing around with the system, searching for things. It's going to be right at their fingertips. So if you want to do this on the NVIDIA Shield, very simple, very easy, scroll all the way up. And then from home, scroll over to the right, highlight apps, and then just scroll down into the applications or install the apps and scroll around until you find Cody. Now, just to be on the safe side, I'm going to highlight Cody. I'm going to click or hold the select button down. And then I just want to go down to info, make sure it is 21. All right, there it is, 21 RC, beautiful. So what I want to do then is I want to highlight it again. I want to hold it, the select button. And then I want to scroll down to add to favorites and click it. Okay, and then I'm just going to scroll all the way up, and then I'm going to scroll over to home. I'm going to scroll back down to favorites, and it's not in the front of the pack yet, so I just want to scroll all the way to the end of favorites, and there it is, Cody, right there. So I'm going to highlight it. I'm going to hold select down again, then I'm going to scroll down to move and click it, and then I'm just going to scroll all, over, all the way to the front. Once it's there, I'm going to click on select again. And now every time you load up your NVIDIA Shield, it should be right in the front. If you're still using an Amazon Fire Stick, just click and hold the home screen button down between two and five seconds. It's going to bring you to some category menus. Click on applications and then perform the same technique within the Amazon Fire Stick once you see the app icon for Cody. So since it is in the favorites apps right in the front of my home screen, I'm going to just highlight it and click it one time. And then once you do, it's going to come up with Cody requires access to your device, media, and files to function. Please allow this via the following dialog box or Cody will exit. You're already going to be highlighted on continue, so click that one time. If you're not, just scroll over to continue and click it. And then it's going to say allow Cody to record audio. Now personally, I'm not doing anything crazy on this device, so I'm just going to keep it highlighted while using the app and click it. And then it's going to ask you allow Cody to access photos and media on your device since I don't have any uh, incriminating stuff on here I'm just going to click on allow otherwise you will not be able to use Cody <clears throat> so once you do as you see Cody loads up and you are good to go and if you want to install other builds obviously I'm going to start making Cody 21 builds or build videos for Cody 21 but I think a lot of the old videos will work as long as the URL is the same and Cody 21 is no different from any other Cody all of the steps are still exactly the same just using 21 and just updating the builds and whatnot okay now if you are new to this <clears throat> Uh, what does this say? Using 21 RC while 21 stable is available. Okay, so I'll just reload stable when I when I'm done making this video, uh, so that way anybody else using it is is gonna click on the stable version. So with that said, the first thing you have to do is for movies, if you do want to install other URLs, is scroll up and once to the right, highlight the sprocket and click it, and then you're gonna scroll down and over to system and click it. And then you're going to scroll down to add-ons. From add-ons, scroll once to the right, twice down. Highlight unknown sources and click it. You're going to get this warning dialog pop-up box. From no, scroll to the left onto yes and click it. And now you've turned on unknown sources. What that means is you're now able to install outside add-ons and builds and repos in order to use with Cody. So I'm just going to click the back button one time. And then you can scroll over and then back up to file manager and click it. And then scroll down to add source and click it. And click on none. And then this is where you're going to put all of the repos of any builds that you want to use. Very simple and very easy. So follow this steps and then any and all of the videos I make from the past or from here on forth are all going to be pretty much these steps. So that way you'll know what to do when uh, I make a new video. All right. So click the back button or just hit cancel. And I'm just going to click the back button, bring myself all the way back to the Kodi default home screen, and then you are good to go. And this is how you download and install the newest version of Kodi 21 Omega on any and all device, me tonight being using the NVIDIA Shield. As always, any problems or questions, feel free to hit me up at any time on any of my social media accounts. All of the links will be found down below in the video description. If I am not readily available because Dr. Venture does work a nine to six job, I do have three children that have sports, gymnastics, school, you name it, I'm always busy, okay? So if I can't answer you right away, I will eventually get to the question. Uh, you know, don't fret about it. If I don't, just hit me up multiple times. But if you need quicker help, 
and faster help on any of all of my videos. I usually post any of the Twitter accounts or any of the Telegram or Discord accounts for any of the developers that you require help with. So definitely check that out. Or I do have the number one Cody Source group on Facebook that you can join, 14,000 plus members deep and growing every day. No hate, everybody's great. I do vet everybody. So if you are going to join, make sure you answer the questions or else you will be declined. And if you are already a member and you invite somebody else, make sure they also answer the questions or else they too will be declined, okay? So with that said, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoy, you know, all of the links down below of the help that I can give you. Hope you enjoy the uh, number one Cody Source group. If you are a member, thanks for joining. Got to say, everybody in there is amazing. Okay, so thank you for joining and thank you for helping everybody out because that's that's what we're all here for to help everybody out. Okay, so with that said, I hope you enjoy this uh, little tutorial on the newest version of Cody Twenty One, and stay tuned for videos to come on all of the new ads, add-ons, and builds coming for Cody Version Twenty One. So with that said, thank you very much, and I appreciate the support, and I thank you for watching.